Hi, Maudo. Good morning. Welcome to a brand new week of learning. And it's also a brand new month. We're in the month of March. That's right. Okay, so today we are going to work in our language book and our letters and sounds book. We're going to do pages 51 and 52 in each of the books. Okay, but before we start, stop, look, listen, special sounds. Thra. Three are stars. Ch. Church. Or morning. Ow. Out. Two sounds. Ow. Oh. Owl, bowl, er, verse, er, nurse, er, bird, oi, coin, oi, boy. Two sounds, uh, uh, and oo. Book, tooth. Work, worms, super good, awesome looking. You're learning so many special sounds. Okay, let's start with our letters and sounds. And let's go to page 51, right there. And sorry, the copy machine kind of made it a little black here, so it's hard to see, but it says, um, circle the special sound you hear in the picture name. Okay, so let's look at this one in the middle just for an example. There's a flower. So which special sound do you hear in flower? Okay, you can do that. Now it says match the beginning sounds. Okay, and then number three says match the ending sounds. So the beginning is the first, and the ending is at the la the last at the end. Okay. Now let's go to page fifty two, and we just learned some of these special sounds. And you know what? I just remembered there was a few more. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I thought I had them all, but actually there's a few more that I forgot. So let me, there's 50, I, night, and all, ball, and uck, walk. The L is silent. Uck, walk. Okay. Oops. Wow, glad I didn't forget those ones. That was a close one. All right. So you know why it just I was just reminded because here we have those special sounds, okay? Circle the special sounds, mark the vowels. Okay, I want to mention something. If you circle a special sound, for example, let's say we circle this special sound. Uck. And we this is a special sound, so we circle it. The A is inside the special sound. Do not mark a vowel if it is inside a special sound, okay? Because the markings mean something. When we put a line, it's telling us that this letter says A. But in this special sound, when we circle it, we know that these three letters together say uck, walk. Okay, so it's very important not to mark the special, the vowels in a special sound. Okay, do not mark a vowel if it's inside the circle because inside the circle means it's a special sound. Okay, when we mark it, it's telling us what sound. For example, we put a happy face, we know it's the short sound, a, a, apple. If we put a line, we know it's the long sound, a, a, acorn. But here, it does not make this sound a ah, or the sound a. Together, all these three letters say uck, uck, walk. Okay? 
Okay, just wanted to mention that. Now, here is were and worms. We just saw that special sound. And I, that means those three letters together say I. We don't pronounce the G or the H, but they have to go in together to spell the word night or all these words. Okay, so when you see those three letters together, you know you need to say I. Okay, and then it says mark the circle besides the picture word. Okay, you got it. Now, let's go to language one. And there's page 51 right here. And it is things that are very different from each other are called opposites. So if they're totally different, they're called opposites. Like in, out, up, down, in, I'm in right, out right, up right, down right, happy all the time, in, out. Those are opposites. Up, down, opposites. Match the opposites, okay? And then it says write the opposites. For example, here, yes, and the opposite of yes is no. Okay? And they're going to give you three words, and you need to decide which one is the opposite. What's the opposite of dog? I'll give you a hint. Meow, meow. Okay. Now we're going to write compound words. A compound word are two words that go together and make a big word, and it means something different. Like here, there's sun, and then there's shine. Shine is to make something shiny. But when you put them together, sunshine. Those are the rays that are coming out of the sun, the sunshine, okay? So we have to put here, what's this? Milk man. A milk man is someone that delivers milk, okay? You can do this, okay? And that is our class for today. I hope you had fun and learned something new. I'm sending lots of love and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.